The historic courthouse had been standing since 1888. Since then, it's been a staple, rich with memories for those in Oscoda County. 9 and 10's Cody Boyer spoke to people torn apart by its destruction. He joins us live in Oscoda County with reaction from them. Cody. Good evening, good evening, Kevin. Rather, actually, crews right now are setting up a fence around the perimeter of this building. This fire destroyed nearly 100, 130 years of history. People here say this building has stood as a symbol of Mayo for many generations. It's one of the first things that you notice when you come through the town. Its white steeple tower has stood in downtown Mayo since 1888. Now it's charred and broken. It's devastating. Chris and Tanya say the loss of the spire is a loss of local history. Historical, the, the length of time it's been here. Just but. another landmark gone. Sandra Holton worked as county clerk more than 30 years ago. Yeah, it's just overwhelming sadness to old timers. Definitely a landmark. It, um, uh, it was one of the few wooden courthouses that had never burned. She remembers learning her father's real middle name and records kept in there. All of my ancestors are in the <laughs> records there, and I think that's all been saved. Jennifer Cronkright's family history with the building goes back even farther. My great, great Uncle John Randall, he actually helped build this uh, courthouse. She has memories of her mother working more than 20 years there. She says last night changed the town forever. After the fire was doused and a lot of the steam was rolling out, and the flag out front was still flying. It's a terrible loss. It's like uh, losing a family member. Now, there is no word officially yet if this building can be saved at all. Now, many hope it can be rebuilt as it once was. Reporting live here in Mayo, Cody Boyer, 9 and 10 News at 6. In the bottom line on the Escota County Historic Courthouse, it was first built in 1888 for $3,000. Nearly a century later, the courthouse was designated a Michigan State Historic Site. That was 1971. The following year, it was added to the National Register of Historic Places. But last night, a fire destroyed the building. Investigators are looking into what caused the fire. 